Good morning. Today is a rainy day, so I thought it would be fun to choose a different poem about rain each day this week. And our first poem is The Rainy Day by Henry Wadsworth Longfellow. Longfellow is one of the most famous and most beloved American poets. This poem is not one of his more popular ones, one that I just stumbled across when I was looking for rain poems, but I really like it. The poem has a somber mood, and that's especially important if you know a little bit about Longfellow's life and can understand how tragedies, personal tragedies in his life informed the mood of the poem. Longfellow's first wife, Mary, died only four years after they were married, and his second wife, Fanny, died in a horrible house fire, leaving him with their six children. So he had, he had a hard life. He lost a lot of people who he loved, and that knowledge, I think, informs our understanding of this poem and the, the sad and serious mood, but also the hope that I hope you find at the end. Before I read the poem for you so that you can think about those things, I want to talk about the literary element of consonants. Consonants is an element of sound, and it is the repetition of consonant sounds in words. You are probably more familiar with alliteration, which is repeated sounds at the beginning of words, but consonants can occur in the middle and at the end of words as well. And I'll show you what I mean in this first line. The day is cold and dark and dreary. One of the predominant sounds in that line is the D sound. The day is cold and dark and dreary. You have the duh sound at the beginning of some words and at the end of other words, and that creates consonants. The effect of consonants isn't isn't a very obvious one. It's not always as obvious as alliteration, but once you're listening for it, you can hear how the words roll off the tongue differently, and the poem sounds more cohesive and more musical when poets employ devices like this. So listen to that as I read the rest of the poem. The Rainy Day by Henry Wadsworth Longfellow. The day is cold and dark and dreary. It rains and the wind is never weary. The vine still clings to the moldering wall, but at every gust, the dead leaves fall and the day is dark and dreary. My life is cold and dark and dreary. It rains and the wind is never weary. My thoughts still cling to the moldering past, but the hopes of youth fall thick in the blast and the days are dark and dreary. Be still, sad heart, and cease repining. Behind the clouds is the sun still shining. Thy fate is the common fate of all. Into each life some rain must fall. Some days must be dark and dreary.